Hi, today we're going to talk about how to create an handle service request. You can create a service request for the follow topics, billing and payments and credit cards, licensing, partners or even subscription and trials. Mail if you have any question or issues with groups, public folders, mail flow, migrations, mailbox, active sync and outlook for Windows, Mac or even mobile device. Sites and document sharing for sites, SharePoint apps, OneDrive or sharing and permissions. User and domain management for domain management, sign-in and passwords, user and group management on even Cortana, identity management for Active Directory, multi-factor and single sign-on, office tools for office related issues, online collaboration for Skype business topics. So in order to create a service request, Go to Office 365 Portal, Admin, Support, Service Request. As you can see, I don't have any service request created. So for start, I will click Add. In this example, I will use Mail. Identify the issue. I will select Mailbox. In Symptom, I will select Recover Deleted Email. Under Issue Summary, I will type a suggestive title, like I would like to know how to recover John Smith account. In Issue Details, I will insert a brief description of the situation. This way, with this brief description, the engineer will be able to retrieve the information and even confirm if the case are on the right queue. Here, usually we have some odd support topics or even technets that will help you resolving your issue. If not, press continue. Here we need some additional details for to find the priority of the case. Is your service unavailable? In my case, no. How many users are affected? Just one. Please insert the email of the affected user. Then, select the domain. If you have any print screen or output that can help on this case, please attach it over here. Review and confirm before submit. Check if your email are correct, your phone number are correct. Please review the inserted data and then submit. Here we can see the information about the case. Case number, title, status and assigned to Microsoft. That means that is assigned to the support team. If we need to change any information on the case, we can click on the number, notes, and here we can put additional information that should be on the case. Add notes. Close. And now we need to wait until Microsoft support contact us. After Microsoft contact, we can see the status app change and the sign as well. Now we have two options. First, you can add additional notes if needed, or we can close the case. I will leave the engineer close the service request. And it's done. 